And welcome back. Go ahead and quick save while I'm thinking about it. Is that a camera or something? No, no, it's just lights. Alright. Five, four, three, two. What? Oh. Neat. Cool. Vault 114. Sounds good. Way to go. Way to go, wasteful man. Oh, wait. Hold on. I should probably eat something. Or drink something, actually. That'll be fine. Yeah. Yarp. <laughs> it does kind of sadden me. Hey, that is so not cool, bruh. Eat it. Hey, do I have lots of apparel that I need to get rid of? That'll work, actually. Mm-hmm. Cool. Carry all this clothes I'm picking up, man. It's freaking crazy. Where is this dude? Oh, I'm gonna... Mmm. I'm gonna beat you, game. I'm gonna beat you. Hold on. Before I do that. Let me make sure that I fully explore this area real quick. It's like more door... Oh, requires key. Okay. Can I open that one? Sweet. Oh, yes. Right away. Hello. Stim packs. And I got the mother load right here. What up? Uh, more. Oh, neat. A 114 jump seat. What's this say? It's going to give me some information about this vault. mentioned in your briefing, Vault 114 will be hosting high-ranking members of local and state government, local luminaries, business people, and their families. Future members are aware that they will be cohabitating solely with the others of Boston's upper class. However, the luxury aspect of this vault has been highly exaggerated to the future residents. Multiple families chosen randomly will live and sleep in single-room apartments, dining, and bathing will be in shared quarters, and amenities will be minimal. In addition, interviewing for the overseer position for many candidates, our goal is to find someone with no supervisory or government experience, and hopefully with a strong anti-authority base uh, bias. Okay. <laughs> Taking away the luxury and authority these groups saw in surface life, we hope to study their reactions 
in stressful situations. As such, please do not undermine the new overseer's authority at all during the experiment, even and especially if it may cause physical discomfort, embarrassment, or harm to residents. Thank you. Uh oh. Hi. Hey, phone. 7.30. Been recording for several hours already. Woke up at 5.30 or so and, you know, wasn't really that sleepy, so figured I'd go. So this was a social experiment that uh, was done to Boston's upper class. I'm very amused by that. I like th I like the concept. I wonder if they got any any information. Hmm. True. <laughs> Dirty rats making me jumpy. No, no. Naughty, naughty. Gotcha. Okay. No. Hmm. Weird. Did I kill him? Must have. Oh, Trigger Man! Gotcha. Okay, good. Good, good, good. <coughs> uh oh. Well, that's fair enough, I guess. Hey, you. It's in a book. The written Rambo. The written Rambo. Reading Rambo. No. Oh, wow. Can't carry anymore. Super. Okay. Oh, neat. Let's go up here and see what's in here. Is there anything of importance? And there's a hard hat. 
mining helmet. That's kind of neat. wonder if the light works on it. Probably not. wonder if the light works on it. Oop. Gotta drop. Okay. Oh, don't tell me you're stuck now, bruh. There we go. Hmm. That's where I came from. Nothing. Why can I not pass through that? It doesn't make any sense. And is frustrating. Let's see, so I'm supposed to go that way, so let's actually go this way and see if it makes a difference. Pretty brutal, man. It's pretty. Mm-hmm. Let's just take the guns from here on out. Oh, yeah, and the food, I guess. We'll be fine. No. I don't need any of these. <clears throat> okay. Four more bobby pins. Can I use this? <laughs> okay, it just has the same stuff that uh, <coughs> as the other one did. How much do those weigh? Oh. Got it. Alright, well, we'll just take ammo then. And all these random loots. And we're out of time, guys. Again. So, uh, we're getting there. We're almost to Nick, I think. I think we're close. So, until uh, next time, Bone Batuna, we'll see you next video.